for the repair of the E slash P EPCON controllers, the following procedures were necessary. Replacement of various electronic components and general cleanup of the units. For testing, we add a 100 volt AC power supply, a 4 to 20 milliamps input signal and some LEDs in order to depict the adjustments the controller. As the process variable exceeds the set point, the controller attempts to lower the value and the LEDs light up. As the process variable is far lower than the set point, the controller attempts to raise the value and the LEDs light up. As the process variable nears the set point, the LEDs lower the blink rate. The same process is repeated for the second controller. The same process is repeated for the third controller. The same process is repeated for the fourth controller. And lastly, the fifth controller. It is now clear that the controllers are working successfully and are ready to be delivered to the customer.